me, guys. If you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button down below or I'll have it like <laughs> floating across the screen right now. And then make sure to go and follow Tiffany on your social medias because she's pretty cool. I, I am like cool. her. Hi! <laughs> so today we're bringing you three little New Year's DIYs. So get into the first craft. Okay, so our first DIY is this cute little crown that you can make. So what I use is, I don't even know what to call this stuff. Like, I really don't even know. Uh, uh, it's, a, it's sparklies. like, it's like a sparkly stringy thingy that's really annoying and I feel like it doesn't really have a point. Like, you don't really use it for any anyway. specific purpose other than decorating and making <coughs> a mess. And this one I actually got from the dollar store, so they're really cheap and it actually says happy birthday on it. But, but we don't care. We don't talk about that. <laughs> we, just, we just don't look at it. I just liked how it looked. I started by making a mold of how big I want my head to be and then I just made probably about like four layers of it, twisted it together, and then I took two other types of string. I had a gold like sparkly string and then a black sparkly string and just intertwined that into it just to give it a little bit more texture. And then even if you make it too big, this stuff is like pretty... What is the word? Flexible. It's pretty flexible, so you can really just like twist it and turn it to make it fit the shape of your head and how you want it to be. So that one is first, and it's turned out super cute and super festive. Yeah! So, <laughs> it's so pretty, just kidding. This Craft number two is the DIY um, confetti poppers. Ooh, fun. And so, you know, <laughs> like originally I was going to take toilet paper rolls and a balloon and fill it with confetti and tie it on the end of it and actually make my own confetti popper, but I found these DIY, like these confetti poppers at the store. So we just got those and they're not very cute. So we just printed out different colors of paper and then just taped it on it. Super easy. Super fun. Yeah, super exciting. And I had to clean it up. <laughs> Did you really? <laughs> yeah, my dad got mad at me. He's like, Alexis, there are sparkles everywhere in this house. I'm like, I did it outside. He's like, they're everywhere. <laughs> So our very final craft is some DIY balloon countdowns. So what you'll need for this is acrylic paint and I actually use fabric sparkles. So what you'll do is you'll paint a clock face on your balloon and I actually did these blown up. I know there's easier ways to do this, like an alternative way is to not blow it up and just use a gold like sharpie, which I wish I had one, but I don't. <laughs> so, no. sad. so we had to hand paint each one of them. They don't take that long. They probably take five like five to ten minutes depending on how fast you are. And then just do a clock phase for each hour or for each 30 minutes depending on how many activities you want to do in that time period. And then fill the balloon with confetti and a little piece of paper that has an activity for you guys to do for that hour. And then each hour you like pop the balloon and figure out what you're gonna do and do it. And that way you won't get bored sitting there waiting for it to Hit midnight. It's like the hardest <laughs> thing on New Year's Eve is like you know finding stuff awake. to do to stay awake. Because <laughs> last year I'm down. pretty sure I fell asleep before. And that's pretty much all of my DIYs. They're really cute, really simple, and super cheap. So you could do them in a few little fun activities for you guys to do on New Year's. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. <laughs> And again, make sure to subscribe down below if you aren't already. And I make new videos every Friday. So hopefully this will get up by or today. Try to every Friday. Try to. We haven't done one in a few months. I I'm going to be better. I'm going to be better about it. So Stay in college. Uh, <laughs> school. I know. So yeah, make sure to subscribe. And then, gosh dang it, Zoe. You can't make this easy, can you?